it's simple for life to become all about playing catch up on emails and texts and about rushing this way and that, trying to meet deadlines and make it to meetings on time. With life in fast forward, it's easy to forget just how important it is to get away. Well, today we're going to do something I've never done before, and that's fish for rainbow trout, uh, and uh, I hope maybe some bull trout too, that uh, are following migrating salmon up from the from Quesnel Lake up into one of the tributary rivers to spawn. And, uh, and I know that's uh, a big thing on the West Coast, and it's a big thing in Alaska, and probably even in the in the Midwest, the Great Lakes salmon and steelhead fisheries. But I've never I've never done that. Uh, I have been to the river that we're going to fish today um, a few years ago, uh, earlier in the summer when the salmon weren't there and consequently the, the big you know, rainbows weren't there feeding on the salmon eggs. So uh, we're hoping the timing is, is, is just right this time to find these fish in, uh, in the river. So some of the places narrowed and there were, you know, logs coming into the water and so the, the jet boat drivers were having to like, you know, avoid kind of running aground on certain, you know, certain portions and then, you know, avoid the logs at the same time. Just simply looking around and seeing, you know, the large uh, grizzly prints on the shore and seeing that, you know, the carcasses of salmon that they had already pulled up on the shore that they were ripping apart or that they had finished with. I mean, that, that added to this kind of, this concept that we really were, we really were out in the middle of nowhere. I mean, people, people, my guess would be they pay thousands of dollars to go up to Alaska to go up and see this. But, but here we are right, you know, right in the Caribou region, kind of right in central British Columbia. And, uh, and this is what's happening right around us. So we climb over the log jam and to get to the place where Skeed wants us to, to fish. And, and, and he's, it's funny, the fishermen are, are impatient to get going. Um, Skeed was probably even more impatient. I, he kept twitching and stuff and wondering when someone was actually gonna get up there and make a cast. But of course, we've got to get cameras ready and all that sort of stuff. So uh, for some reason, I think it's probably had to do with <clears throat> age. I got to step in the water first and, uh, and I did. And uh, Skeed said, cast over on the other side of those fallen logs you can see in the water and there should be a whole bunch of fish stacked up in there and the water is just colored enough from I guess glacial silt that you can't really you can see the, the, the salmon but you can't see the trout it's almost like they're transparent I believe I had a, a strike on my first cast which I missed and then I had, had another strike in my second cast and caught the fish and we were kind of away for the rest of the rest of the morning A little to the left. <laughs> Great. Wow, look at that. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, oh. You're going to make this look too easy, Jim. Beautiful color. At one point throughout the day, we'd, we'd come around the corner and, uh, and we'd gotten out of the boat and we were fishing. And there were some grizzly bears that had come out to the stream and they were just downstream. Oh, Jim. There, there we, we go. go. <laughs> there are the double. Whoa! <laughs> oh, 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 look at that fish, Derek. Oh. 
Today was one of those days where, like, if I make it to be a grandfather, I'm gonna, it's one of those days where I'm gonna tell my grandkids, you know what? I had one of those days where I was out fishing for, like, fishing for massive rainbows and massive bull trout. And the only other anglers on the stream that day were the grizzly bears that were across the stream from us. Um, we were fishing in the mountains where very, very few people get a chance to get a chance to go up and fish an area like that. I mean, we were fishing in Eden.